To balance this equation, I have 5 plus H2O. That's iodine pentafluoride plus water. Let's count the atoms up on each side of the equation. We have one iodine atom, five of the fluorines, two hydrogens, and then the one oxygen. On the product side, we have one iodine, one fluorine, one hydrogen, plus we have to count this hydrogen here in the hydrofluoric acid, so we have two of those, three oxygens. Hmm. Let's leave the oxygens till last and let's balance the fluorines. We could put a five in front of the HF. That would mean we'd have one fluorine times five. That would give us five of those. So those would be balanced. But then for the hydrogens, let's update those. We have the one hydrogen here plus the one times five. So now we have six hydrogens. Let's balance the hydrogens. That might even fix the oxygen. So we need six. So let's multiply this by three, coefficient of three, two times three. That gives us six hydrogens. Those are balanced. And the three, it applies to the whole water molecule. So the one times the three there, and that does fix it. That has three. And now this equation is balanced. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for IF5 plus H2O, iodine pentafluoride plus water. Thanks for watching.